amygdala. <laughs> I'm going to provide a link to, well, I'll show you some of the research I've been finding. No, not arugula. I like arugula. What's up? <laughs> amygdala. It's this, somehow somebody found out that like that's the part of the brain that deals with the whole fight or flight thing. It deals with like high stress responses kind of thing, whatever. And I'm wondering, you know, oh my God. So it, it poor, yeah, I guess I, I, I showed the video yesterday, but it raining. So then I have to get the, um, which reminds me, I can go back out there now and finish. So I had to wait for everything to kind of like dry before I started sweeping everything. I can sweep a little bit. This is dangerous. I shouldn't be doing these things, you know. Today, the, uh, what, uh, yeah, 710, 2020, what's up? So, uh, yeah, I was wondering, I mean, people keep saying to me, Jason, you're not, well, you know, you're not the same kind of Christian you used to be. You used to be really aggressive on people. It was like a now kind of thing. You got to get right with Jesus Christ now, which, yes, you do. <laughs> That's to get happy, calm. But the reality is this, the reality. I was not so much calm myself. You know, Jesus is going to come back soon, which, by the way, he, he, he came back. He's living in you. That's the whole preterist thing. Everything, you know, the you know, Holy Bible's been fulfilled in terms of prophecies. But there was always a sense of urgency. And if you look at the years, and there should be a sense of urgency with regard to life in general. Just be happy. You know, you got to get, got to get going and living now, you know. But if you look at this person, <laughs> Jason Werner, and any kind of medical conditions with which he was diagnosed, and you kind of like look at more, look more into this stuff, you know, the MRIs and stuff, yeah, and it's not the slightest bit uncommon that you're going to have, oh, look how beautiful it is out there right now, look at the sun, how bright it is, damage to the amygdala. So it's, it's, that's, like I said, the fight or flight thing, and, and it causes people to get really jittery, in my opinion. Well, that's just the kind of word I'm using, but it's like a now kind of thing, urgency. You know, and there had, my, my attitude always was that it's got to be a sense of urgency when it comes to, and where, you know, for the last like three hours, I've been researching this stuff, you know. Anyway, yeah, amygdala and multiple sclerosis, there's a direct correlation. That's the whole point of this video, and um, the link will be provided.